Amico Aspertini, also known as Amerigo Aspertini, was an Italian painter and sculptor who was born in Bologna in 1475 and passed away in 1552. Aspertini's art style was considered complex, eccentric, and eclectic, and is seen as an early indication of the Mannerism movement. He is also known as one of the leading figures of the Bolognese school of painting, which emphasized a close observation of the natural world. Aspertini's paintings often featured classical and mythological themes, as well as intricate architectural elements. He was also commissioned to create sculptures for various churches, including the Basilica of San Petronio in Bologna. Aspertini's bold style and experimental techniques paved the way for future artists to explore greater creativity in their own works. Amico Aspertini was born into a family of painters in Bologna. He studied under renowned masters such as Lorenzo Costa and Francesco Francia. At a young age, he showed great promise and traveled to Rome with his father in 1496. During his time in Rome, between 1500 and 1503, he was influenced by the works of Pinturicchio and Filippino Lippi. He returned to Bologna and began painting in a style that reflected these influences. During this period, he created two notable collections of drawings, known as the Parma Notebook and the Wolf Egg Codex. In 1504, he joined Francia and Costa in painting frescoes for the Oratory of Santa Cecilia, commissioned by Giovanni II Bentivoglio. In 1508-1509, Aspertini found himself in exile from Bologna due to the fall of the Bentivoglio family. During this time, he painted magnificent frescoes in the Chapel of the Cross in the Basilica di San Fridiano in Lucca. His talent was further recognized when he was chosen as one of two artists to decorate a triumphal arch for the entry of Pope Clement VII and Emperor Charles V into Bologna in 1529. Aspertini also contributed sculptures for doors in the San Petronio Basilica in Bologna. His artistic abilities were not limited to painting, as he also adorned facades and created altarpieces. His works were characterized by their eccentricity and emotionally charged expressions. A notable example is the Pieta inside San Petronio, which portrays an otherworldly scene against an electric sky. Aspertini was known for his unique personality, which Italian Renaissance artist Giorgio Vasari described as eccentric and half insane. According to Vasari, Aspertini possessed remarkable ambidexterity, allowing him to work rapidly with both hands, dividing chiaroscuro between them. He could paint light with one hand and shadows with the other. Vasari also noted that Aspertini often complained about his Bolognese colleagues copying the renowned artist Raphael. Despite these challenges, Aspertini left a significant impact on the art world. He passed away in his hometown of Bologna, leaving behind a legacy of exceptional and imaginative artworks that continue to captivate audiences to this day. To sum up, Amico Aspertini was a highly influential Italian painter and sculptor who made a lasting impact on the art world. His complex, eccentric, and eclectic art style served as an early indication of the Mannerism movement. As one of the leading figures of the Bolognese school of painting, Aspertini emphasized a close observation of the natural world in his artworks, which often featured classical and mythological themes. His bold and experimental techniques paved the way for future artists to explore greater creativity in their own works. Aspertini's exceptional talent and imagination were recognized through numerous commissions, including the creation of sculptures for the Basilica of San Petronio in Bologna. Despite facing challenges and being described as eccentric, Aspertini's legacy as a remarkable and visionary artist continues to captivate audiences today.